the problem I have with some popular YouTubers is that when they are infuriated about certain things or when they are angry about certain things, they take certain decisions that would affect other people also, right? TV. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Princess Panigo and I'm an Nigerian, you know, reactor, content creator based right here in Lagos. And yes, you're welcome back to the channel. The returning and the new subscriber, thank you guys so much for clicking. So guys, for a while now, there's been a gist going on about African Tigress. And I said not to put my mouth in it because, you know, I didn't bother to go and even look for the channel right or copyright claim was being given to. But let me break it down for those that will not understand what I'm trying to say. So African Tigress is a Kenyan YouTuber who, you know, is not in good terms with Wodemaya for reasons that, you know, we don't know. Wodemaya has come out and apologized to, you know, everybody and let peace reign. She's, she says she's, she's not going to accept the apology because it was not done in private, right? So we don't hear that one. No problem. We don't want to accept. No problem. Let everybody rest. But African Tigress, also, wherever they're talking about Wodemaya, she shares the video. Whether they're saying anything bad about Wodemaya, she shares the video and she leaves her comment there, right? So people that are, how do I call it, are uh, Wodemaya's lovers. They started defending Wodemaya and giving it to African Tigress, obviously. I don't know if African Tigress has, you know, people that are defending them or not me it's not my job to defend any youtuber my job is to see what is going on and talk about it i don't have time to come and defend with the maya or defend african digress or defend dim wango or any other youtuber i can only defend myself and i'll talk about any situation that is i see on the street i'll just talk about it like a normal person i'll talk about it and i go i can't defend anybody i can't fight for anybody yeah i heard that african tigress started striking channels that take our videos okay and you know use our videos in a negative way if you take a clip and you know she'll strike you and i feel like she has every right to do that if she wants to do that because if you take my clip and you go beyond the normal fair use there's what we call fair use on youtube for those that don't know that fair use is like i think 30 seconds or so i don't know so i think that is the height but i mean you can google it you know if you're really interested in that i've not bothered to google it all this while maybe i will after this video so there's a fair use guide nothing beyond 30 seconds you know to buttress your point or whatever right now she strikes a channel down according to how we had i don't know i don't know the person but i mean it's the information that's been flying down a couple of people have done reaction about it that she's going about striking channels that you know use her content i feel anybody can strike if you carry my full content and you abuse me in it of course i can strike you and and you know she so she has every right to do that but what i don't understand is why african tigress is taking this thing too far yes i feel like she's taking it too far at this point you might ask me why as i said on this youtube before me i don't hate anybody you know we might not be in talking terms i know send you you know send me yeah but i don't hate anybody now african tigress has come out to say that you know she's even teaching people how to go about you know, you know block and um, reporting channels that if they report channel this that that is going to happen to the channel this that, that is going to happen to the channel to report channels i don't have a problem if you want to report if you want your people to go and report channel african tigers but you know that some of your people some of your subscribers that will just see your thumbnail on video they might not even watch the video to hear the context of what anybody has said on that video and they'll report and really if you are a social media person now nah, i mean like you should know that it's not everyone that will come out and talk good about you. Even with the Maya, there are people who slander with the Maya's name. And I don't think with the Maya has reported everybody because if he reports everybody, I mean, there's still publicity coming to you one way or the other. If, no, they say no good publicity and no bad publicity, right? There'll be no bad publicity as they say it. So I don't think this one that you are saying that teaching people how to go, that if they watch, some of your people, they will not watch the video. To know the content, they just see your thumbnail. And as content, as a reactor, sometimes we use clickbait titles that might not say, Oh, I love African Tigress, or you know, whatever. You use a clickbait title so people will click on your video and then they click on the video to listen to what you have to say. Anyway, with my I don't say make I need to do click it too much before, but whatever. So African Tigress, me to me, oh, this one that you brought out, it does not make sense. It does not make sense at all. It does not make sense. If you have an issue. YouTube, yeah, yeah, YouTube should, you know, tackle it out. Don't come and, you know, tell your people to go and be reporting channel. And they are coming to my channel and leaving silly comments, okay? Leaving silly comments on my channel, not even watching the video that I, I, I did to know what is the context of the video or whatever, you know? I mean, like, 
Even on arrest, if everybody on YouTube is, you know, reporting everybody, would, would, they, would there be a social media? If all the celebrities that they've talked about and they are coming out that they want to report, all their fans should go and report, what will be happening on social media? Me, I feel like you should relax, African Tigers, at this point. Um, that's your idea. It's not going to be favorable. Even for those that maybe like to watch your content or whatever and they talk about you, it's not going to be favorable because some of them just see your top picture on the thumbnail and they'll just come and be giving unnecessary reporting to people's channel, right? And it's not why I love you. I mean, I'm not here to defend anybody. I don't have that time. I don't know if maybe it's because they cut her chain. I heard that she went to Kenya and they almost cut her chain and the chain is not even good or whatever and they almost cut it. I don't know if that is the reason why you know, African Tigers has decided to be angry. I don't know what is making her very, very angry. I mean, like, you're a big YouTuber, you're a popular YouTuber, you have over 200K. People will talk. I mean, it does that mean that the thing is getting to you that much? They will talk because even when they are talking about somebody that you are not in good time with, you are there in the comment section clapping for them, sharing the videos, right? You are sharing the videos. So people will talk. And not everyone will like you on social media. So me, I feel like uh, there's nothing I can say. You have already posted, but that's your this thing is not going to work out. African Tiger at all. It's not going to work out. It's not going to work out. I don't know why people cannot just accept this apology and let everybody rest. I said for the Maya apology now. And people should settle this thing and move on and not, not use your reggae and blues to affect you know all YouTubers that are trying to do their own thing. Yeah. And now they'll go and report somebody for, for nothing. Nobody should report. <laughs> I don't know what to say at this point. It does not make sense. Uh, I don't know what the unnecessary fight between Wodemaya and African Tigress is that the thing is lingering on. But African Tigress, you said you know that the way you have your lovers, Wodemaya have lovers. Let your lovers come outside and reply to the people that are fighting you now. Abi, Shebi, you are not to have lovers. Let them reply and fight for you. Wodemaya's lovers are fighting for him. Let them reply and fight for you. Let the fight be, be between. You know, two lovers are not you involving yourself in it. You, you are a big YouTuber with over 200k. You're just supposed to turn blind ears. You're not even supposed to be going to comment where they are talking about Odumaya and clapping hand for them. Right? As I am here, I will hardly go to where I see that they're talking about my enemy and start clapping. If I'm a very big YouTuber, but I'm not big yet. So when I get to that point, maybe I will, I will start doing like that. But for now, you know... African Tigers, please, though, people should review this thing. I don't understand the issue that you guys have decided not to review. I want to use it to, to, to um, 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 disturb somebody. You were even breaking it down word for word, how they should go about it if they see any harassing and bullying. But the people that are doing video about Wodumaya and talking about Wodumaya also, don't you think that they are harassing and bullying Wodumaya? The people that are coming out to insult Wodumaya and talk trash about him, is that not harassing and bullying also? As Odumaya, um, 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 you know, killed them or whatever. This is not even, at this point, this one is not even making any sense to me. This, your, this one is not making sense because people that are not involved in it, once they see your, your picture on the thumbnail, they will use their head and carry it too. So, and you cannot say people should stop doing reaction video. Me, I'm not scared though, because even if they do the whatever you say that YouTube is going to do, I'm not scared, okay? They will do it. But YouTube will still review the channel and everything will still be okay in the end of the day. But really, it's not making sense. I don't know what is getting to you. You should go and try and make peace out so that the reaction will stop. Okay? And even though they even make this peace, reaction will not stop because even if it's not about to demand, it's not everybody that will still like you on social media. It's not everybody that will love you. It's not everybody that will want to fight for you or whatever. It's not everybody that wants to be with you. It's not everybody that will like you or enjoy your content. I don't know why Africans see. I don't know why African T cannot just, you know, understand this. And you want to use your own records and, and spoil other people's blues. Please, though, you push guys to settle the issue. And not allow us to use your face in peace. And allow us to, um, what is the word? Not harass you or bully you, but um, there's a word they used to call it. I'm trying to think of I cannot remember the English. But people are allowed to talk. You, we cannot shut people up. It's not, we will watch video, we see, and we must talk. Oh, we must talk. That's what I, I came here to say. Push you guys set to so that we will talk in peace. Thank you. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching this video. And, you know, feel free to leave your thoughts in the comment section. Do you think African Tigers, you know, wanting channels reported, you know, is a good one? Or do you think you should settle with, with Maya already and let everybody do Let everybody rest, okay? What do you think? Let me know in the comment section. And I'll see you guys in another video. I'm angry. I'm angry. <laughs> Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching and bye for now.